Hello and welcome back to Let's Play over 700 Super Nintendo games. I'm Circle Master. The last game was terrible. Let's let's see if we can do better with this one. Bazooka Blitzkrieg. Sounds promising. Unless was this a Super Scope game? I'm not sure, but this might be a Super Scope game. Hey, K Shizzle. Why am I doing this to you? You should be asking why I'm doing it to myself. Uh, I'm being told this was a Super Scope game. So, we will all get to see the joy of figuring out if I can control a Super Scope game with a mouse in SNES 9X. Oh, that's loud. Let, let's let's adjust that down for you folks. Shoot screen. Okay. Use super scope. Hey, I've got mouse control. My God, this is loud though. All right, that's that's better on my ears. I had a real super scope. I think I still have it, but it doesn't work anymore. Uh, let's let's do Bud Camp and see what it is. I am absolutely a novice. I've never touched this game before. I had, I don't think this is the game that I had. No, this is not the game that I had. I just did the aim thing. Leave me the hell alone. Push pause. How do I push pause in the mouse? Got this, I don't know what the... I don't have a pause. <laughs> uh, input configuration. Nope, that's not it. How do I get out of this screen? Oh, there we go. I found it. I found it, now I can't sh Oh, I have to right-click to shoot? Oh wait, no, I do have shooting, it's just super delayed. This is a very slowly scrolling thing. I do appreciate the environmental damage that I can do, though. Now, I'm trying to remember the name. How are you not... Please die. Um, oh, there was a... Uh... Oh my goodness, thank you. Hinkosha. I'm trying to remember the name of the Super Scope game I had. I think it was Battle Clash, but it's like a Gundam-esque mech fighting. Except you're only shooting. And it's like a not really a plot point, but it is mentioned that you have a separate pilot and they are their own character. So it's like, it's a mech game, but you're, where you're not a mech, where you're just like the arm that shoots. Is 
this doesn't feel like a tutorial or anything for me. It feels like looping infinitely. Can I bail out of this? Nope, that's a just aim. Oh, I screwed up my aim now. There we go. I really hope this ends at some point. Yeah, he could certainly move a bit quicker. I have a feeling that, like, he's, um, riding in the back of someone's mobility scooter. That there's, like, an 80-year-old woman who's slowly putt-putting her way to the grocery store, and we just jumped on the back and started shooting people. And that explains why we were going slower than walking. Now, Segway's not this bad. Like, you could ride a Segway faster than you could walk. Is this the end? There, I don't... There's nothing appearing. Yes, a Roomba. We are a battle bot. We are a Roomba with a machine gun taped to the top of it. Accurate. I'm getting get scored for accuracy in a Super Scope game. No, I don't believe that. Okay, let's play it for realsies now. Uh, I'm still a novice, though. Oh my goodness, we're a traitor Roomba. We're destroying our own kind. This is terrible. There's gonna be a moral choice later in the game where we have to decide whether to to betray the humans and join our people or continue to be a tool of a species that created us. What will the Roomba do? This, this looks a lot like the boot camp level, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, it's Cylon Inc. I don't know if they were intentionally going for the Battlestar Galactica reference. Because at this point, Battlestar Galactica had been off the, the air for... Uh, at least a decade and a half, I want to say. Boo... On Kosho with the Groner. Yeah, if they're going to score me on accuracy, I'm just going to give up now. Because I'm just going to go to town. And I apologize to everybody's ears. I did turn this down in OBS. I'm not sure if I turned it down enough. But I had to reduce my own, like, headphone volume by over half to make this bearable. Well, if I leave the robots alive long enough, they will shoot me. I've also somehow taken a hit. Oh yeah, because there was the one that was right up against the screen and didn't die for a while. So he had... I just got an L. Is that not supposed to be life? I didn't get any life. Did I just get ripped off? Or did I start with this much life? I don't think I started with this much life. See, they're a little faster on the trigger now. 
I got my one missile that I used back. Oh my goodness, I'm being raided by one person. That's still right though, so hey, I appreciate it. That was it, Hellbeat. Thank you, Hellbeat, for joining me. Why did I do that? There was nobody on screen. Oh, I guess there were people at the top of the screen? So yeah, boot camp was just this first level. What a ripoff. Oh no, I have a boss. Is there anything I can do to block the shots? I don't think there is. Like, what am I supposed to do? Wow, you get one life. How lame. I better get a... No, this is the first level again. Do I have to do the entire first level over? I'm gonna be sad. I'm gonna be really unhappy. I guess that one can live. <laughs> so the lesson is just pour missiles into the boss as soon as you find the weak point so that you can damage race it. See, I didn't gain any life for that. I think I'm just at my max life even though it doesn't fill the bar, which is a weird choice. Um, for varying definitions, I'm making progress. I don't know if it's good progress. Um, I was stuck on Act Razor for quite a while. Uh, just because it's a, it took me a while to get to. Um, but yeah, this is game eight out of over 700. So there's a ways to go. Uh, another robot gets to live, that's fine. Can't wait to see this at GDQ, and it's an auto-scroller, so you can really speedrun it. Those are the best games to speedrun. Okay, so there are a bunch of people that jump down that the bomb deals with. Um, I Act Razor is the first game that I've gotten to that was actually a good game, or what I would call a good game. Oh my goodness, just die. Okay, so these I can shoot. But bullets, not so much. And now what, this part? I'm guessing this part in the middle, yes. Cool. This, the boss starts with the unblockable damage and then goes to blockable damage. That's weird. It's a giant airship. The Final Fantasy villain of the week is doing the robot thing. It's Sephiroth. No, that was... That was not in the 16-bit era. It's X-Death. Yeah, this is awful day awful games done comprehensively. I don't know. I don't know what would start with Q that could work for that. Awful games done quite a lot. I can't shoot these background ones. That makes me sad. I don't even know what that was that I got. M, I guess, is missiles. There's some life. Okay, so that was a decent chunk. Oh, he just became invincible, I guess. 
Oh, that's a bad thing. That's a that's an anti power up. No wonder it wasn't doing anything before. It was just hurting. I just did it again. My goodness. Oh, hey, Zylo. How's it going? I'm playing a Super Scope game that honestly is not the best Super Scope game out of the very few that exist. Which I'm sure is a surprise to nobody. Okay, boss time. What is the weak spot of the boss? It's these things. Screw you, things. dangerously low on missiles now. What is this? Just a whole bunch of different targets. Oh, so some of these are going to shoot at me. That's rude. I really don't get the the pattern behind this. I also can't seem to destroy the top or bottom ones. Okay, there's the top one. Hey, I guess I didn't need to destroy the bottom one. I wonder how many stages are in this game. What? Am I hacking the mainframe of... what? What does that even mean? <laughs> I'm I'm ha I'm going to hack the mainframe with bullets. This one weird trick that IT does not want you to know. Okay, I don't know what that was. I think that was supposed to be a bomb, but it said R. That is a really narrow spot to hit that robot, and I cannot imagine trying to do that with an actual super scope. It was a rub bomb. It's like a bob bomb, except it's Rob. It's Nintendo's Rob. He very slowly turns and delivers the bomb to you. And then you explode and die. Okay, he gets to live. And he gets to live. He doesn't. 
Uh, he does. Uh, what is that noise? I guess it's over now. Whatever it was. A lot of these enemies aren't even shooting at me. They're just flying past me going... Just hail fellow traveler. As they go by. They're on break. They shouldn't be using the company property of the flying motorcycle things. What's the flashy part? Oh, geez. Those came out quick. What am I supposed to shoot for damage? My goodness. Oh, I guess the arms can take damage. Sure doesn't seem like it. It's very inconsistent. What? Was this the tutorial or was that the entire game? I'm not sure which is worse. That it's a three-stage tutorial or that was the entire game. That was the entire game. I, I guess the real battle is when I grab a machine gun and shoot up someplace for realsies. I'm not trying harder mode now. Screw that. No, we're done. We beat it. We beat it. Uh, I, yeah, that's, that's it for Bazooka Blitzkrieg. It's not a fun game. It's not nearly as good as Battle Clash, but I am glad that Super Scope works on this. So thank you very much for watching, and until next time, take care.